Welcome to Get Database Training, guys. You are listening to Saf, and this is the sixth tutorial of this video series. A short tutorial on how to save an SQL script file. So here in our management studio, we have a script file which contains few queries and comments. Before I continue to add more queries, I would like to save this file because I don't want to end up losing this script. And at the moment, this file is not saved. We can say this by looking at two indications. Firstly, there's a small asterisk sign at the top of the session. Secondly, there's a vertical yellow bar on the left. So now, in order to save this file, we have three different approaches. One, by right clicking here at the top of the session. Two, by clicking here on the save icon and three is the traditional way to save any file which is click on file click on save sql query dot sql navigate to your destination folder and give this file a name i'm going to name as the name of my database which is saf underscore db dot sql with the extension dot sql click on save and that saves my file again we can verify by two things the asterisk has disappeared from the top and the left yellow bar has now turned to green henceforth if i wish to add any further sql script or queries all i have to do is just to keep pressing on the save icon so that will update my saved file so that's all for now I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Should you have any queries, feel free to drop us a line. Also, visit our website to access many more online training resources. Lastly, I would request you to please do like and share this video. Leave your comments below as I would love to hear from you. And subscribe this channel for many more online training resources. Also, press the bell icon for instant notifications. I'll be back with another tutorial soon. In the meantime, keep practicing and all the best. Thank you.